Hey there, welcome to another video. Real quick, just do it. I don't know why, but for the past couple weeks, every time I've gotten on TikTok, I've seen a lot of moms doing crazy stuff. I don't use the word crazy in a judgmental way. You could use other words, forward, bold, oversharing, whatever, man, Wh whatever makes you feel better. And I don't judge moms because, you know, moms have to have kids and uh, they typically have to have kids with, you know, uh, some dude who probably loses interest in that kid and gets more interested in football and stuff like that So, you know, just in general moms have a have a wild experience in life This thing pops out of them and then it becomes ugly and then they have to buy it braces and support it for six years While it tries to get you know better looking and gets a job and becomes productive and then by that point They've lost it kind of like I have in this whole rant. So today's video is all about moms You know not for any other reason than a bunch of moms have been in my algorithm. So sit back, relax, and consume these moms with me. Let's eat these moms together, all right? First up on the docket, I don't know what this is or what it's gonna be, but we will find out. Hi, baby. <laughs> I don't blame her. I feel like having a kid must feel so powerful. You must hold that kid's head at times and you're like, I could. I could mm, the soft boiled egg in my hand. I could just, mm, I'm a sick person. Hey guys, it's me, Noel, with less facial hair. I just had to interrupt the video real quick to thank the sponsor of this episode, which is SeatGeek. You know, I've worked with SeatGeek for a long time and I'm super excited to be working with them. Not because they told me to say that. Live events are back and that includes all kinds of stuff. Let me just look at my phone and see what's available now. As of right now, there are 71 events for Monster Jam. You know, I've been waiting for the day I could go back and see a monster truck live in person. Whether it's football, baseball, basketball, concerts, festivals, uh, or more, SeatGeek puts tickets from all over the web in one place to make buying simple. SeatGeek rates every ticket from zero to 10 to make sure you're getting a good deal. Green means good, red means bad. Uh, and I've got a deal for you right now. If you use my code NOEL, you'll get $20 off your first set of tickets at SeatGeek. That's $20 off your first purchase with my promo code NOEL. So make sure you click the link in the description or download the app. Remember, that's code NOEL for $20 off your first SeatGeek order. Uh, get you some tickets, see some monster trucks. Now let me hand this back to me with facial hair. All right, next. Yeah. Hey, look, it's everybody in the comments section. Damn, son. Next. Child support, father ain't sent the shit. So what if he did? It's none of your dang business, kid. My mom, there's no one else quite like my mom. <laughs> What? I know Noah already did a, a voiceover of whatever this is, you know, like a beautiful rendition of this song. So everybody say thank you to Noah because he does those vocal renditions of all the songs we can't play because, you know, copyright. It's like, <laughs> it's my mom asking me to spread her cat lips while she gets it. <laughs> That's crazy. Just. I want to know how she did it. Was it like, did she get down on one knee and like, you know, like that? Like an electrician or something? Like getting in the wall, just looking around. Did she lean over her mom and, you know? That must have been a wild experience for the piercer to have another like face in the mix. Like, hey, I know my mom, she just, my dad's never really been around. So there's no one really to support her through these things, you know? <laughs> Great clit, by the way. <laughs> Already first praying, this says glizzy prank on mom. I don't know what's next, but I, why am I expecting this dude to put the hot dog into his mom's mouth and for them to be like, wouldn't be far fetched for this platform, right? You just have to hold your arm straight out mm -hmm. and try and eat it. Look, ready? Mm. You better clean this Slush. stuff. Shut up. Hang on, here you go. Put your arm straight out. Mm -hmm. Close your eyes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Go. Ah! <laughs> Bitch! You fucking hoe! You fucking hoe. <laughs> that is love right there. When your mom can just casually call you a fucking hoe. That's the type of relationship you should strive for with your mom. Before we start this, I haven't had a chance to say this publicly anywhere really, but since TikTok changed this text-to-speech voice, I, it, it, it makes me like, <clears throat> this is the voice of a nurse 
that gives you an enema. Like it's an enema nurse voice. Okay, bend over and I'm gonna put this in your butt and clean out all the poop. A picture of your engagement ring. Jay never sent it. Isn't it so pretty? He did so good. It's very quaint. I see he didn't invest too much money into it. He's always yes, been smart he is with good his with finances, money. but he got exactly what he knew I would like. I don't like a lot of bling. I like more dainty jewelry. Reasonable. Well, that's good. He had asked for my original engagement ring to propose to you at first, but I told him no. I was saving it until I thought he was really serious. I guess he was serious, but now you can save it for his younger brother. Oh no, I will hang onto it for Jay in case he ever needs it in the future. He always has options, he may need it. <laughs> you know, you look at moms like that and you just wonder if they think their kid is hot or something. I understand wanting the best for your kid, but being involved to that degree, like, oh, my boy has options. Why do you even think about it like that? I mean, is, is, that, is that too far-fetched to say? I think that's an appropriate time to, you know, remind an old person that they're gonna die, like, soon. <laughs> I, think that, I think that's that situation calls for that. He's got options. Oh, does he? Oh, hopefully you live long enough to see him explore them all. That Medicare is running out. Knock, knock. Who's that? It's death. All right, this one is captioned, I may or may not be the world's meanest. Mom! I was knocking on my daughter's window. I'm dying. That girl for real said hello. I'm right here, bitch. Does she stop? Is she ever gonna give up? <laughs> you know, on one hand, I understand the immediate reaction is to go, this is mean. I'm a terrible mom. It's fine, dude. What is she, like 13? She's got at least 40 years to go to therapy and like get over it, you know what I'm saying? To accept it, whatever. This is how moms get some reinvestment into themselves. She watched that thing cry and she wiped poop from his butt and changed his shitty pee pee diapers for years this is her getting just a little bit of feeling back going back to that you know getting some of that anger out <laughs> i am so done watching anime on illegal websites because that jessica's five miles away from you it was my mom <laughs> You know, it's crazy. She says that. And I just saw a picture of a Reddit post about a person talking about, you know, their mom's OnlyFans is really affecting their life. Whole time she was watching these anime deaths. That was just the dude in the next room. I am 20 years old and my mom thinks she can still take my phone when she's mad at me. So I took her kitchen. <laughs> if you got a mom that cooks, that is, uh, oh man, that is... Mwah. Mwah. No pun intended. Compliments to the chef. The funniest part is TikTok always starts trends. So 700,000 people have liked this. I I'm sure there are there's going to be many more instances of this. And it's just going to keep getting more exaggerated. Like I know one mom is going to take some kid's phone away, come home, and the stove will be completely dismantled and rebuilt in their like, you know, in, in her like <laughs> shower or some slush. Went out for my 21st birthday? And my mother decided to come with. Y'all see that? Why is your mom doing that? I gotta see that again, bro. That was impressive. You heard someone in the background? What the? Look at the look on this kid's face. I could tell from this TikTok, this is the start of a beautiful Oedipus complex. You just had a baby. What the next 24 hours for you are gonna be like? Spoiler alert, 
This nice will be your best friend. The first time you get up to go to the bathroom, blood can trickle down your legs. You may even leave like little droplets of blood on the floor going to the bathroom. No, I won't. Because all I did was hit. Nice shot. Next. Mom, can I see my baby pictures? Mom, can I see my baby pictures? Mommy, can I see my baby pictures? She has hands with the phone and the kids are going through the photos. And it's all the videos from her OnlyFans on the night that the kid was created. <laughs> oh, jeez. It's fine. It's got plenty of time to go to therapy to figure it out. Child support. Father Eminem. It's just, again, so overpowering. Who accidentally booked the same hotel as a furry convention and called me confused to ask what kind of sports team these mascots are for? Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, I think they're mascots for the Predators. I think that's what that is. It's a real team, by the way. The Predators. Whole time, whole time she was plotting on you. The whole time. Yo. <laughs> Leave a comment below. If your mom has banged your ex, I want to know what that's like. That's a competitive woman right there. <laughs> uh, some women just cannot stand other women being happy, even if it's their own daughters. That's crazy. Probably enjoying that relationship for who knows how long. And her mom couldn't stand it. Look at this stupid bitch sleeping in my house, using my electricity, bringing that man in here. She's got some fucking nerve. I keep these lights on. If anyone's having fun, it's going to be me. Well, I think that's going to do it for mommy TikToks. I think that was a, that, that, that covered it all. The only thing we're missing is a very left field breastfeeding TikTok. I know, I know you've seen them. Don't even, if you just looked at me right there and went, huh? Shut the f*** up. You know exactly what I'm talking about. And also I want to let you know, uh, if you don't know, Cody and I are doing a live stream show. On August. It's going to be at momenthouse.com slash tiny meat gang. What are we doing? We're doing a live that's cringe. We got some special guests. Spock is doing a DJ set. We filmed a very special Cody and Noel do where we learned how to sword fight and we go at each other's throats. Tickets are 10 bucks. It's a brand new format that we're trying out. It's going to be live from the ship. It's going to be a great time. So uh, we hope to see you there. That's momenthouse.com slash tiny meat gang. And uh, I'll see you next week with another video. Later. Hey, just play you, man. I had to switch it up. Yeah, might lose a few, ask me if I give a fuck